what's going on aries welcome back to the channel it's me antonio here with another channel tarot card message for you today been uh frolicking through the park man <laughs> thunder and lightning is on the way so spirits like go ahead and get some messages so we are gathered to see what spirit wants to relay through the card of man see like share subscribe add value to the channel so that we continue to grow let's get into the messages we're using a gold universal tarot deck today Mm -hmm. I didn't really get a chance to put out too many messages yesterday. It was raining. And then recently, I've been like, huh, I've been putting so much content out lately. Yo, I feel the evil eye on me. I can feel the jealousy. <laughs> you know, people seeing you upgrading in life, and next thing you know, your energy slowly starts to get drained, right? Yeah, we. I see the star card. But I'm contemplating. I'm, I'm like, I've witnessed... Uh, this before with karmics what they like to do is run and hide underground and you know block off social media accounts and stuff like that So I'm like, I don't know. Maybe that's not what I should be doing. Maybe I Should be on full display like a teacher would showing agape love and showing what confidence is supposed to be about right? Aries is the leader the firstborn right? the head start All right, so let's see uh, we'll see what social media is looking like. Maybe I'll just not post as much, right? <laughs> Blabbermouth, right? But let's get into it. Grounding your reading today? Exactly. Seven of Swords. Someone sneaking around your energy here. They're either stealing your ideas um, or they're misinterpreting the, your thoughts and your words and the things that you say. They may be gossiping on you, but de definitely tiptoeing around you here. Whether inside or outside of your peripheral, this may be online, but this could be also people that's close to you as well. Someone that's probably a friend or family member. Not sure if you've met anyone new, you know, you um, allow the, re the reading to resonate how it needs to resonate. But someone's misinterpreting your energy here. Perhaps your thoughts and your words. Let's get to it. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, it has to be someone that you live with here or someone that's around you on a daily Possibly someone that you work with with this being Pentacles as well. It could be like a co-worker, a supervisor, or uh, someone that's intent on misunderstanding you here. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're going through some sort of a health issue or something like that. Ten of Pentacles. Look at that. As soon as I said Ten of Pentacles, here comes the dropping of hmm, the fruit. We still have that flower here. It hasn't even died yet. <laughs> so keep going, Aries. There's a lot of abundance on the way here. I'm not sure if you're currently manifesting some sort of a legacy. Uh, multiple sources of income. Some sort of an uh, entrepreneurship. Again, business that you've recently opened up. But this is great abundance here. Mm -hmm. And this is how people are viewing you as well. You're going from the Five of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles. So you could be on some sort of a health journey as well. Yeah. Could be trying to avoid some sort of a toxicity. Some sort of a medical diagnosis here. I'm not sure if this is surgery coming up for you. It looks rather expensive, right? The thing is, right, um, with medicine or with health, right? Um, you want to. What did it say? You get it. You want to use. It only takes an inch of um, prevention <laughs> before coming across a, a boatload of cure, right? Or, or whatever the the thing is. It's like you take care of your health. With just little minor small, small things at first, even with your monies and your finances or your relationships, before it turns into this big snowball effect of madness, right? People want to wait to the last minute, or like they would say in Revelations, the end of days to people wanting to come running to the church asking for forgiveness, banging the, on the, 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 the doors of the church down, Mercury retrograde, right? And again, I'm not even a big Bible number. I don't even remember the last time I went to church. But again, we use these poems and these allegories to um, make a point or make a statement, right? But, uh, yeah, very curious here, right? Amateur fire sign energy. So this could be some sort of a uh, minor content creation that you're into or someone's coming towards you. They're very curious about um, your finances, your health, mm, how you make money, something like that. This could be a little bit of jealousy, right? Seven of Swords reminds me of the Seven Deadly Sins. And we get these Six of Wands. Yeah, your fanfare. So people are coming towards you, they're wanting you to be successful or they're wanting to see you as being successful, but of course that's not everyone, right? <laughs> you can't have all the people love you all the time is what that uh, old saying would be. But yeah, definitely, whatever you're creating right now, um, 
I'm sure some form of uh, artistic work. Uh, you could be an athlete or a dancer. Maybe you do some sort of a yoga. Again, you could be getting your health together here. I do see um, working out, right? The one stands for um, physical activity, right? Travel and movement. Adventure here. Yeah, this could be detoxing. Someone's uh, working out or uh, doing high intensity training, right? They're detoxing here, probably drinking. <laughs> this is something else that I used to do. I told the story about how <laughs> hanging out with my friends who are all drinkers, I would, be the, I would be the one to take a shot and then chase that shot with a shot of water. <laughs> and then the next day be in the gym and the sauna sweating out all the toxicity, right? Because I had a liver transplant. I'm not like everyone else. I probably shouldn't even be drinking anyways. But God gave me a second life, so why not partake, right? The things that I would have died of for no reason, right? The doctor's telling me that I have the liver of a 70-year-old man at 17 years old, although I never drink, right? The good die young. Why? <laughs> we have the strength. So very strong um, ability to make finances is what I'm getting. Now, for me, the strength is, right, what's internal, the DNA. Or someone could be looking at you with some sort of a beast. This is weird channel messages. But for fire sign, interesting energy here. So maybe someone sees you as competition here is what I'm getting. Yeah, because she's trying to wrestle this lion's mouth open. Mm -hmm. I'm almost getting images of uh, Shikari Richardson in my head. I know she recently won a race. And I, knew, and I know about a couple weeks ago I uploaded um, a couple scenes from the movie The Animatrix. The black dude that broke through the Matrix. Um, he was a track runner. So, right, again, this could be people envying you, spying on you. This could be, like, uh, bad-mouthing you as well. Or they're trying to steal your style here. Wands are, are known to be what um, models as well, right? Style, right? Fanfare. Mm -hmm. We got the, li the lightning coming in. I'm not sure if that is a uh, confirmation or what. We have the Divine Feminine. Yeah, this is how you're being viewed as the uh, Divine Feminine here. Or this is the person that's uh, currently watching you. Maybe you're some sort of a teacher or you're some sort of a nurturer here. But that's Libra and Taurus energy here. Very divine, very luxurious, right? Comes right on top of the Ten of Pentacles. So yeah, someone sees you as very divine and very luxurious. They're wanting to have this together moment with you. They're traveling towards you for this cup. So yeah, I mean, lust, envy, you know, it all comes from the, the same thing, right? I mean, what's hate really, right? <laughs> it's someone that loves you so much that they can't stand the, the, the fact that they have those sort of feelings for you here So someone could be romantically intoxicated uh, With your energy or something like that I don't know, maybe they watch you physically or watch your photos They enjoy the way you look Six of Cups, yep They wanted to come towards you with some sort of a gift This could be someone that you possibly know from the past I'm not sure what social media you're on, right? Maybe someone that you grew up with, went to school with. Maybe you went to some sort of a party. Maybe again at work because we have pinnacles here. Queen of Cups. Nurturing energy that you're putting out here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Right? Detoxing, right? Rinsing something out. Overshadowing the negativity. Could be a singer or uh, a dancer or artist, right? A good way to get out negativity and... Um, yeah, negative energy out of the body, right? Also a good way to stay healthy and active. Could be dealing with a teacher or a comedian. We do know that the King and Queen of Cups are my news anchors as well. Anything else I want to pull here? Mm -hmm. I think that's it. But someone's extremely attracted to you. They see you as having a... Um, they see you as being very um, fertile, of course. Uh, very creative. Uh, very abundant people love to come towards you you could be dealing with a leo or uh, again uh, some sort of a divine feminine here or someone that wants to uh develop um their third eye here possibly that's a strange message mm -hmm. they're needing to do more research rather than spying and tiptoeing around a situation here my advice learn something new every day keep a clear channel right you can only control what you think say and do that's probably what you're showing this individual here Again, I'm revamping old videos myself and put them in, putting them in a proper context, fixing up the, the, uh, the titles and everything. So, falls in line with content creation, um, along with those two major arcana. Yeah, you have a, a large presence here. Like, look at this. In the cards alone, the Divine Feminine and the, the uh, Alchemist here. The Strength card, you have a strong Divine Presence here. Six and six, right? Victory coming towards you in love, right? Even a celebrity, people are wanting to give you a standing ovation and liking what you're doing here. 
and that is all I have for you here today. You're being viewed as some sort of a teacher or some sort of a nurturer here. Right? You may even receive uh, donations and things like that. Mm -hmm. Very abundant. The other high court card, right? People are coming towards you. They're very curious, very sexually attracted to you. They're enjoying your art, your artistry, whatever it may be. Maybe you're some sort of an entertainer, right? Maybe you're an expressive artist. Mm -hmm. right? Being able to take your emotions out of something. So you could be dealing with an actor. But that's what I have for you here today, Aries. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel. What's hiding? Yeah, see, they're sexually attracted to you here. Yeah, they wanted to come towards you. You're very um, creative. You're very idealistic. You're not afraid to try new things. And this is what this person is liking about you. They're seeing you as being very creative and very sexually attractive. Very adventurous, right? But that's what I have for you. Like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel. Fire sign. Peace.